Hey, what's up, everyone? Super Sonic Sai One Two Three. Today we are still continuing our let's play on Sonic Origins Plus. So last time we completed Sonic One with every character. This time we're going to be doing Sonic CD with every character. So we're going to select Tails here, and we are going. Ooh. Well, that was fun. <laughs> All right, so here we are playing as Tail. So what we're gonna do in this uh, in this let's play, or in this yeah, in this part of the let's play, is that we're gonna try to get all the time toads and destroy all the uh, generators. So that's it. That's how you 100% this game. And I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I don't really Sonic, Sonic CD. I mean, oh my god, this it brings back memories. Don't get me wrong, but CD. Definitely is one of the games. I okay. Here we are, going back to the past. All right, let it bounce off, and there we go. But 100% in this game is definitely a pain because, like, uh, for a guy who's played this game a lot, <laughs> like a lot, you think you would know where all the time generators are and where all the mouse on holograms are. But I don't. I don't. And the other way, and the other way to get a time stone is to at least get like 50 rings and hold them and hold them until you know to the end. But that's what we're gonna do anyway. Uh. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? But yeah, CD definitely, definitely a special place in my heart because. Oh my God. Well, it's still a special place in my heart. Oh, there's my the final hologram. Uh, but CD definitely a special place in my heart because, uh, this game was literally, and I repeat, literally the first Sonic game I've ever played, ever, on the Sonic Gems, uh, collection. So technically, Sonic Gems is the first Sonic game I ever played, but, but that's a collection of games. This was, like, the first legit game I opened up, and, you know, I loved it since then, and I still love it now. Uh, it definitely hasn't aged well, I can admit, I commit to that, but... Yeah, nostalgia is just it's just flowing through me right now. And uh, fun, fun, funny enough is that uh, the Wii that I uh, was using actually uh, okay, so and like I played Sonic Gems Collection on the Wii, and you guys are well, you guys should know about the bet. Excuse me. Where's the music? Not that I care, but where is it? <laughs> Did the game glitch? Did the game do that? Did the game do one of those glitches? Did the game do one of those? Oh, never mind. Okay, so it just was quiet for some reason. Okay, I was about to say, did the game do one of those? Had one of those things called a bug? Okay. So where is the Where's the stupid generator? But anyway, as I was saying, uh 
the only reason how I play this game is because I had a Wii, and we all know the Wii can play GameCube games, so thankfully we figured that part out. So, yeah, my library of games was definitely not, not big, not that big when I was growing up with the Wii. In fact, the Wii wasn't really mine, it was my uncle's. I just played on it, you know, just to... I just played on it, uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, another thing too, uh, yeah, it was my dad that got me into games, so, yeah, and I played this game when I was three, so, guys, I've been a Sonic fan since I was, like, oh, God, I thought that was gonna be my death, okay, so, yeah, I've been playing Sonic games since I was three, so, yeah, think about it, guys, in fact, this okay oh okay i know where we are yeah all we gotta do is climb up here and the generator should be yeah right here and we made ourselves a good future all right so uh, actually, if you grab the time stones and don't destroy the generators, you will still get the good future. Uh, but I'm gonna do both. I'm just gonna do- I'm gonna do everything. Because, you know, I'm that type of guy. Like, let's see, uh... Now, I don't have debug mode unlocked, I mean, which is probably fine. I mean, I didn't unlock debug mode when I, when I first beat this game on Origin. But I definitely did it back on my Xbox 360, so that's something to keep an eye out. Alright. Now, I, mean, I would say that these special stations are not the best, because, like, uh, technically, if you want to be all cheeky about it, this is the first 3D Sonic stage. <laughs> like, these best stages are probably like the first time Sonic's been in 3D. Of course, people want to, of course, people want to say that Sonic Adventure is the first 3D Sonic game because people don't want to remember 3D Blast. Alright. But yeah, sorry if my, uh, sorry if the gameplay here is really slow. Uh, this game is not really fast paced whatsoever. Uh, it's, it's nothing but platforming, which, oh crap, don't go to the future, we need to go to the past. But yeah, in order to unlock debug mode, you gotta do a, a crap ton of stuff, which I don't feel like doing, so I think I'm just gonna do this normal. Okay, so... Okay, pass. Here we go. Now, all we gotta do is get to the pass. Which, how do we do that? Oh, are you kidding me? Here we go. Time to build up some speed. And to the pass we go. Now I actually don't remember where all the generators and where the metal sign hologram is in the second act. But I'll do my best. Try and see like Oh, there we go. Alright, so do I keep go I I guess I'll keep going backwards, okay. I don't wanna lose all my rings. So I need to be very, very careful. I think it's somewhere below. Yeah, it's somewhere be below. Hmm. A 
Let's see, where is it? Where could it possibly be? Oh wow, we got to a uh, hundred rings. That's cool. Okay, shield. Perfect. No. Oh, here we are. Okay. There we go. We destroyed the metasonic holograms. So which I don't think they do anything, but you know. Alright. Go and special ring. Shine about the I have no idea the lyrics. <laughs> but I do like the ending theme. And we made a good future. I will say the special stages is oh wow oh yeah that's loud on my headphones I will say the special stages do look pretty like look at that look at that uh like look at that like look at Jupiter right now look at Jupiter and in special stage 4 it gets uh there's like an island that looks like that looks a lot like Sonic OVA Sonic OVA before it became a thing Also, uh, a little advice, if you touch the water, uh, you will drain some rings, so keep in mind in that, like, for example, my time just went completely down. Oh my god. Okay, so the time generator just popped to spawn in. God! What? Oh, hey, oh no. I should have hit that. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Bro, there's no... Oh my god, thank you. Did y'all see that? I phased through like three of them. That's another thing about these special stages. It may look like you're gonna hit them, but you're not gonna hit them, so. <sighs> Second time stone. Also, you, you guys. Also, do you guys want to see this? <laughs> you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Work that sucker to death. Come on now. Work that sucker to death. Work that sucker to death. Come on now. Work that sucker to death. Uh, I would have beaten that a lot quicker, but I like listening to music. To the boss music. But yeah. But yeah, that boss fight right there is so easy to beat. All you gotta do is just get behind it, uh, jump Eggman three times, and you're good. Tails made a good future. Alright, so that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Please come on and subscribe. And next time, we'll be going through Collision Chaos. So yeah, see you all. Have a good day. Peace. And take care.